folks. Uh, this is my listing in South Boston. It's a uh, two-bedroom, two-full bath uh, condominium. Let, let me uh, wait till this. Hold on. Oh, there we go. Let me start this again. This is my listing in South Boston. It's a two-bedroom, two-bath condominium. It's on the market right now for four sixty-six five. And I wanted to give you a uh, a tour here. Um, this is a 24 unit association and it's fully uh, owner occupied right now. Um, the building was built in 2004. Um, most of the units were built, excuse me, were uh, occupied in 2005 by the time they were all sold. This is a first floor unit. And uh, as you'll see here momentarily, it's very nice. So, walk into the hallway here and it moves out to the kitchen, which is fully applianced. Bosch and Gen Air appliances. Okay. Wash and dryer in the kitchen, in a, um, in a kitchen closet. And the wash and dryer does come with the unit. Uh, my folks here, they're moving to Costa Rica, so the uh, owner is a big plant lover, so if anybody wants to take some plants, uh, <laughs> she would be more than grateful. She loves her, she loves her plants. Um, Center Island right here. Uh, you know, if you want to have some breakfast. So let's go out to one of the main attractions of the unit. You have direct access to the outdoor space here. She's one of the uh, few unit owners that really take advantage of this. She comes out, she works from home, she works on her computer, she, so she takes a chair out, plops herself down, works on the computer. So they're thinking about doing a, uh, they're thinking about doing a, um, uh, a grill out here, but we'll see what happens. Uh, it's the condo association that needs to uh, agree to that. So here's the other advantage. The other, other advantage is that you have direct access to the back of the building here, and that's good for bringing in storage, uh, excuse me, bringing in um, uh, uh, groceries, bringing in uh, furniture, anything like that. This is a one-way street, no parking on the street. Uh, you wouldn't uh, come on the street unless you uh, really lived here. So that's, a, that's good, no traffic uh, for the unit owners here. So let's go back inside of the unit here. Oops, excuse me there. And then we'll, uh, we'll head over to the uh, bedroom area here. Uh, this is uh, a closet for your utilities here. Don't worry about any of that stuff. It's uh, your heating system. This is uh, one of the bathrooms. They have a cat, so the kitty litter box is there. And it's a full, full bath, which includes a shower. Okay. And then they work from home, so they use the second bedroom as an office. All right. And this is uh, the picture out to the uh, center courtyard there. All right, so this is uh, what you get in here. So a lot of office type stuff. This can be used as a nursery or a second bedroom, probably best used for a single bed or a, um, a single bed or a, um, uh, a full size. This is the master. They have a king size bed in here. All right, this is very big. Um, so this has a, a master bath as well. And, uh, uh Let's take a look at this. They added these vanities here, all right? And then they have a whirlpool in this, in this bath here, whirlpool bath, which is very nice, all right? And let's keep on going here. Sorry for the blurry, unstabilized uh, video here. This is my first time doing this. Um, all right, and this is just a uh, coat closet there. So I'm going to show you one last thing. I'm going to show you the parking spaces that this unit comes with. And uh, we'll go down the stairs to get to the parking spots. All right. Refuse, any garbage right there goes in that closet. And this is the parking garage. This, uh, this unit has uh, two parking spots and they are right over here okay um, 
tandem, and that's storage behind, so you do have storage rights with this uh, property. Condo fees are about three, what are they, three, three, uh, they're in the threes, actually. actually, I don't know the exact number right now, but um, some people say that they're a little high, but they just replaced these doors, cost them $30,000 for the association, and the association was not assessed, so that's a big plus. It's sort of a, a thing with me. Um, lower condo fees equals getting assessed, higher condo fees equals more money in the budget. So that's my tour. Uh, I can't give you the address. Uh, feel free to give me a con uh, to contact me if you'd like it. MLS rules uh, say that I cannot give you the address. So very nice uh, property. Thanks for uh, taking the time to, to watch the uh, video. Take care. Bye-bye.